Look at this fancy item. Minus one defense for all enemies. Interesting. Pretty sure I can just stash that though. That does not seem very useful. Like only one defense. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can get rid of this bow now. Oh, hey, I actually do have a mana egg. Uh, can I buy any magic of that right right now? How do I, how do I buy magic of that? I can sell this for 1500. Well, no, I'm gonna keep that. And there's more weapons here now. Cool. Oh, look at that sword. Oh man. None of this is any better than what I currently have, though. How do I how, how do I buy magic? I guess I just can't buy magic here specifically. I gotta go somewhere else to buy magic. Yeah, yeah, I have the cabin key now. I should probably go use that. Letter from Justin's mom. Interesting. I, I guess I can store that for now. And I guess I can put away the steamer pass and the greaves and I don't need this axe anymore. I don't need the wind charm. Look at the items glitch and turn blue when I scroll. Cool. I guess I don't need to use the spirit stone right now. I can use that later on when it's more useful. And all right, that all seems good. I wonder if I should use the defense seed right now. Uh, actually, you know, I'm not going to because whenever I get a permanent stat boosting item, I usually just spam them all near the end of the game. So I get like a very quick stat boost without grinding before the final boss, whatever that may be in this game. Yeah, now that I have the key, I can finally go in these rooms, right? I like how when you walk next to the curtain, you can hear the curtain flap to and fro. But there doesn't appear to be anything important in this room. Yeah, no. Fancy song, though. This is the same exact room as before. And these NPCs are not giving me anything. All right. Just wait. The unique aroma of Hernandez Habarino hot sauce. I remember it's tongue on fire. The last time I had a, I had tongue on fire. It was so spicy. It was like my tongue was on fire. That's it. I tried it once a while ago, but it was so spicy. I couldn't stop crying. Can, I, can you have one now? Can I take one and then use it during battle and then get fire elements on my normal attacks? Yeah, probably not. Why are these guys standing in a circle like this? What are y'all doing? You did it. I see you in a new light now. You sure did fulfill your promise. I knew you'd be able to do great things, Justin. Oh, for me, that was a piece of cake. Right, Puffy? Puff Puff. Puff Puff? That, that, that was a question. What did, what did I do by sinking that ghost ship? I didn't really do anything. I never imagined that I'd be saved by a kid like you. You must be full-fledged now. Full-fledged. I like the sound of it. Saved. Oh, wait a minute. Was that ghost ship attacking? And I sunk it? Oh. I didn't really get the impression that it was attacking us, but that guy just said that I saved him by sinking it, so. Justin, up. Uh Joint Operation Athena, or, and you succeeded. You do pretty well for a kid. He, <laughs> of course. Don't forget your ship work, neglect that, and it don't look so good, right? Roy, you're already a great adventurer. Now just aim to be the greatest adventurer in the new world. I never imagined that you would be so useful. You're quite a guy, but Sue being a stowaway might have been planned by the sea spirits all along. So I must be like a goddess of luck or something. Sue, a goddess of luck. Let's not get carried away. It's like on the nose foreshadowing and then Sue grows wings and flies into the sky because she's a goddess of goddamn luck. Hey, you're really great. Would you please sign this? Everyone will be jealous. Hey, <laughs> oh, really? Sure. I will treasure your signature always. Oh my gosh, everybody here is so nice. My beloved Crane Elizabeth, you're a fine woman. You saved us even now. We, well, we had to make repairs this one time, but it was nothing. Wahahaha. Good luck with fixing her. That crane saved our lives. Yeah, it was all the crane. Yeah. Okay, I talked to every NPC there. They're all still just standing in a circle. I don't know what they're doing. Uh. Captain? Do I gotta talk to the captain? Hi, captain. 
Justin and Sue, you two have done well. You've worked hard as sailors, and you did well as adventurers, too. Keep it up in the new world. Yes, sir, Captain. I'll do my best. If you don't, you might get the barrel. What about you, Fina? Justin, I was really bossing you around on the ghost ship. Sorry about saying those things. Yeah, that was super warranted. I was there. I saw it. Ah, don't worry about that. I thought maybe I could learn a few things. Tee hee, thank you. I'm glad you feel that way. I'm glad you feel like that. Nothing in here. I'm not trying to flatter you, but Justin and Sue, you show promise you're going to be good adventurers. Really? Hee hee, I thought so to myself. Me too. Guess we're going to see this through to the very end. I like how this game doesn't really have a plot so far. I mean, it does have a plot. We're, we're going to the new world and we're going to discover the new world, but like... There's no antagonist. You know what I mean? It's just... We're, we're just walking around, wandering around, waiting till we get to a new world. You know, like, like this game is very easy going so far in atmosphere. Alright, I don't, I don't know what to do, so I'm just gonna sleep. I talked to a lot of NPCs and nothing happened, so... Yeah. Good morning, let's go swab the deck. Alright. Oh, there's a cutscene. So, it's Justin and Sue. Come to swab the decks? Too bad, you're fired as sailors. You don't have to swab the decks. What? But fired? Why? What for? We're working so hard. <laughs> what are those faces for? Just listen to me, okay? We've reached the new world, Valencia. The, yeah! The voyage is at its end, huh? <laughs> Look, go up to the, to the go up to the bow. You can see the new world. Oh, oh boy! I, I'm excited too. Goddamn long load screen. Let me see it there. I'm super into this. I want to see it. Justin, what's wrong? It, it is something wrong? I can see it. There it is. Okay, no, nothing's wrong. Oh, wait up, Justin. Incredible! And it shows a meteor coming down to crash into everything. Sorry, Justin, what's with with that much space? You can do lots of ventures. Puff, puff, puff. Haha, <laughs> puffy. Don't worry, there's plenty of delicious food there, right, Justin? Is that it? Is it that land over there? It looks like a bunch of red mountains. Say, are you listening, Justin? Yoo-hoo, Justin. Oh, I heard you, Sue. He's enamored. The new world. We're really here. I can't wait to find out what's out there for us, Justin. Nice. I am super into this. Look at the water! Good morning, Justin Sue. Hi, Fina. Even though I still think Justin is kind of a dipshit, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm still very happy for him, and I'm still proud of him, so. Ah, new parm, it's been a while. You two. Is this your first time to the new world? Welcome to New Parm, to Alencia. The continent of dreams and hopes. You two are very welcome. Continent of dreams and hopes. I know your dreams will come true, Justin. Say, hey, Justin, get ready to go ashore. Tell me when you're going ashore. I'll go with you. Awesome. So, is Fina a permanent part of our team now? Is she really going to... Stay with us through to the end. So you two are ready to go ashore? Oops, I still have to say goodbye. Why do you, why why would you say goodbye to these people when you didn't even say goodbye to your mom? What do you have to say? Nothing. All right. Bye bye. If I didn't say goodbye to my mom, then none of these people deserve a goodbye. So whatever. Great, we're finally going to land at New Farm. 
Yes, love this song. So triumphant. <laughs> Look at how wobbly the textures are. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yippee. We did it. We're the first ones here. Oh, this is adorable. Wow, we really did it. We've come to a new land. You're right. Now I can finally start the great adventure I've been dreaming about. Oh, I can't wait. Puff puff. What if it's not all that it's cracked out to be? Oh, they did the sailor high five. Ah ha ha, you two are just too much. So what do we do next, huh, Justin? I'm going to the Adventure Society. I've got an intro letter from my mom. Oh, the Adventure Society. You mentioned that before. I guess this is where we say goodbye. Eh, are you coming with us, Fina? Sorry, but I have a reason. If you like, come see me at my house. Just take the road from New Parm and follow the Merle Road. Okay, as soon as I get the chance, I'll go to visit you. Goodbye, Fina. That's wrong. Oh, no. What's the matter, Fina? Um, I forgot something important. Justin, could you raise your hand like this? Oh, what's what for? It's okay. Just raise your hand. Come on, hurry. Mm, just as I thought. Well, here it goes. Hey, oh, Fina. I get it. The adventurer is greeting. Cool, isn't it, Justin? Hmm, Justin, you seem to have what it takes to be an adventurer. How about another adventure sometime? Well, time to say goodbye. You may you have the protection of the spirits on your great adventure. Oh, go after her. Nah, I'm gonna see her again. Where is she? Where's where's her house? Look at this village. A whole new brand new place. You have new fancy looking NPCs, they're they're benevolent god. We are always, always so thankful and grateful. Excuse me, sir. Why are you standing on that barrel? Why? Well, because when I stand way up here and preach the holy gospel, it sounds more holy. Really? Is that true? You're an interesting looking NPC. Hey, kid, there's a nice hotel, a great view, and a three-star restaurant, too. Wow, who knew a hotel was here? Guess we ought to go see it. It's the big building in the plaza near the entrance. Sign says Adventurer's Hotel. Go see it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wait, is this the... Is, is, is this the Adventurous Society place? I don't know. Let me talk to you. Yawn, I'm so sleepy today. I wonder if I get paid just for sleeping, huh? Hello, do you have some business here? Some business? Well, yes. I want to become an adventurer. Oh, no. What a hassle. The procedure is to go to our main office in the plaza at the center of town. Okay, where's the center of town? Look at this water. This water has a different effect on it than the other waters. This water is kind of bouncy. Water back in the first town was not like that. <laughs> okay. I like how the map for the for the overworld is a pirate map. That's a cool detail. Look at that, it's a pirate map. Well, basically. Where's Fina's house? That's the adventure store. Store! Yes, this is what I want. Oh, 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 that's a staff. There's a, there, there's a big old heckin' staff right there. Uh, <laughs> I, I have one mana egg. Oh boy. Range attack with a ring of fire. Range attack with sharp wind blades. Restores HP of one friend a little. I don't know why I would buy that, considering Sue has something way better than that. Or ups the fence of each party with Earth. Ooh. And you can also combine spells, too. So you can, like, combine fire and wind. I mean, burn and howl to get bolt, apparently. Or, or howl and heal to get ice. What in the world? This is, this is crazy. Okay. And wait, plus one agility for Howl? Wait, does that mean whenever I use Howl, I gain a 
agility boost? Is that what that means? That sounds useful if that's what that means. But I'm guessing burn can burn the enemy, which is also useful. You know what? I doubt it really matters this early on in the game, which magic I'm buying. That's something that probably matters more later on. So I'm just going to buy Howl because I've already seen what fire magic kind of looks like. So I might as well try something new. So, yeah. Awesome. I bought a thing. I hope it's good. Okay. I was kind of worried about that purchase. I don't know what or or like how good that magic is. What is this? Oh, stashing place. Hey, <laughs> listen, I came here to New Parm just recently, but I got to like this place in no time. Oh, wait a minute. I'm, I'm just talking to this random NPC. No, I I'm, I'm meant to stash some items. Uh, actually, hold on a second. Get item. I'm guessing I need my letter back. So I'm going to take my letter back. Welcome. Would you like a room? Let's see. Yes, a room, please. I'm hungry with a meal, please. Nah, forget it. Save game. Save the game. I don't think I need to sleep there right now. I'm like fine on health. Um, wait, am I? I don't see why I would be missing any health. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm good. Where's Fina's house? Where is it? I'm looking everywhere. House three, house two, house one. Which one is Fina's? House six. Nope, I didn't mean to go in there. I don't care about these other houses. I just want Fina's house. I want to see Fina again. Pawn shop. Look at this turtle. Oh my gosh, it's scary turtle. Oh, that's a huge creature. You really get a sense of how vast this continent, this new continent must be, huh, Sue? Yeah. Can I ride it? Probably not. Where, where's, uh, where, where's Fina's house? New Parm Church. I like how this village is in the middle of a bamboo forest. This is a new song. Can I examine anything? Oh my god! Oh. You, you, you can examine those. Cool. What are you doing here? We haven't had a wedding in so long. We've got to get this place nice and clean for the occasion. The priest told me he'd clean up the storeroom in back. I wonder if he's finished. Is the storeroom over here? I guess there's nothing in there. Oh, this is the storeroom. It's, it's in back. Ah, ooh, I am a... I am the priest. Is there something you need? I, I, I'm rather busy right now. I take the underground passage to go clean the church bell. I haven't cleaned it in a while. Gotta go ring the bell. That's odd. I feel kind of odd, kind of weird talking to that priest. How do you <laughs> so there's no need to mock him like that. What if he has an impediment or something? Don't be rude. Oh, this is a fancy place. Can I go backstage? No. Don't stop me. Sometimes a man just has to go and this is one of those times. What? What are you? Where are you going? On an adventure? An adventure, huh? Listen, don't be silly. Hey, it's just an act. It's theater. Interesting. Oh, please don't leave me here. Without you, my dear, the world has no meaning. And please, please take me along. There's a lot of personality. Look, all, look at these nurse joys walking around. Look toward the stage. They brought in a real drama troupe from the city. That actress, Miss Milk, is so popular. Miss Milk, you ought to become one of her fans before it's too late. Don't wait until it's too late. <laughs> well, should I? But I don't have time for theater. I'm busy with my adventure plans. What do you mean too late? When is it too late to become a fan of something? If anything, becoming a fan of something too late is the best time to become a fan of something. Because then everything's already... Like, 
re revealed and settled, so like all the shows are already released and you can watch all the episodes and you don't have to wait. Another reason why it's better to get into something when it's too late is, is because you don't have to deal with the fan base when it's in its prime. Because that's when the fan base is always worse, you know? Adventurer Society, uh, uh, that's it. That's it, right, right fucking there, dude. But no, no, I can't, I, I can't go in there yet. I have to find Bina's house first. I have to do that first, obviously. I can't find it. All right. This is it. It's the Adventurer Society. I've been, living in, I've been living in New Parm, but there's one problem here. You see the town is surrounded by poisonous snakes! Exclamation point. That's the one big problem. Something should be done about that. Puff. Cut it out, Puffy. You can't eat th these snakes. They're poisonous. Oh my gosh. I go in here. Wait a minute. Is that, uh, uh, Fina on, on, on that poster right there? You're at the counter. Do you know what you're doing? Welcome to the Adventurer Society. What kind of adventure would you like? This person has a unique profile picture. I wonder if that means they're important. At the Adventure Society, we've set up all kinds of adventurers to meet the needs of our dear customers. Set up adventurers? I'm not sure what you mean. Well, anyway, I'd like to go to Alent and see the Angelou Civilization. Alent, the Angelou Civilization, I'm afraid I haven't prepared any tours for that area. If you'd like to see some ruins of Angelou, you can go to the Dom Ruins south of New Parm. That's fine, I'm sure we're sure to find something good if we go to the Dom Ruins. How do we get there? Unfortunately, we found that the Dom Ruins tour is kind of dangerous, so we don't send tours there anymore. You don't go because it's dangerous, and adventurer should always be dangerous. That's a hint. That is a on-the-nose hint. I have to go to the Dom Ruins or something. How do I get there? To enter, you must say the password. Say it right, or I won't let you in. Oh, uh, the password. Oh, I need a password. What password? Tell me the password. Is that right? Come on. Is that right or not? Then you need a member of the B Society. You need the presence. Okay, he's back there in the office. If you become a member, will they guide us to the Dom Ruins? I'm afraid no one goes there now. Once you are a member, you get a map of Valencia. You can go on your own. Password. How do I... Okay. Wait, 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 what? 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 Oh, I think I- did, did I just- okay. I think I just got the password from the receptionist, but I was just mashing through the dialogue, so I didn't get to read what it was. I don't know, I kind of had no idea what to do, and I was lost, so I just resorted to mashing buttons, and I did it by accident. Alright. I don't- I don't know what the password is, oh well. Back in the cutest guy in town, yup. Yeah, yeah, I like your honesty, but that's not it. You, so you can't come in. Uh, yep, yep. All right, what is it? The second one. Ding dong. Okay, you can come in. Uh, yep, uh, yep. Okay, that's the password. Whenever an RPG has a moment in it where you have to talk to an NPC multiple times, th those kinds of moments always go right over my head. Those kinds of moments are what really get me stuck. All right. I'm Mr. Packin, the president of the Adventure Society. Uh, yup, yup. You need to- you need my help with something? Oh, uh, you're the president? You must be joking. I thought the- I thought the Adventure Society president was a Mr. Goss. Goss was my daddy. He died a long time ago. Now I'm the president. Uh, yup. Really? I mean, uh, so you are. Justin, don't forget to ask about joining. Right, well, since Goss is dead, I have no choice but to deal with this bozo. That's- Justin, don't be rude. He might be more competent than he leads on. <clears throat> anyway, we'd uh, we'd like to join the society. How do we do that? Membership's already full. A uh, yup. You gotta get some adventurers to lend you their adventurers passes. A uh, yup. 
Now, wait just a minute. Look here, I've got a letter of introduction from my mother. My father was an adventurer. He knew Mr. Goss. Ooh, what if... What if I talked to this guy before I took my mother's mother's letter out of the out of the chest I wonder what would happen if 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 I forgot to take it back hmm so I see so you thought this piece of paper would get you an adventurer's pass I'm the one who decides who gets to have a pass a uh, yup yup just toss that piece of garbage but no don't toss that keep it it's sentimental value can I examine any of these posters? Can I examine this? No. I made up some new adventure passes when I became the president. Uh, yup. Clever, huh? Um, oh, what is this? It's got Spina's picture on the cover and this kitschy pink color. Kitschy? Kitschy. Yeah, her picture looks horrible. Spina's on the cover because she's a cute babe. A yup, a yup. Spina's our number one adventurer. And she's my fiance. Yup, yup. We're a real lovey dovey couple and we're getting married soon. Yup. No kidding, but why would Fina want to marry a clown like you? Because he's secretly awesome, is that why? Uh, hey, th that's rude. Now I'm never gonna let you into my adventure society. Yup. What? Is that true? Is he lying? I'm gonna get Fina to come in here and kick your ass if you don't give me a ticket. Don't act so big, dude. You're just my servant, a uh, yup. Huh, what, your servant? Since where did I become your servant? Since you, since before you came in here, remember? You said I'm Mr. Plankton's servant, a uh, yup. Oh, there. Oh, that was the password. Yeah, but, oh my gosh. I'm never gonna let you, let rude people like you into my adventure society. Now go home, yup. Wow, looks like we hit a snag here. Forget the adventure society. I can go on an adventure by myself. This guy's a dipshit. I'm never gonna let rude people like you in All right, okay, well. You're missing out on not letting me join. I'm, you're not invited to my birthday party. Ah. Sorry, I didn't know the Adventure Society had a new president. But anyway, why would Fina get engaged with someone like him? Because he's clearly lying. What would you think, Sue? Well, it's hard to understand, but I think Venus got bad taste. <laughs> yeah, even so, we don't have other plans. Let's go see Pina at her house, huh? I'm sure she'd at least lend us a map. To get there, we must have to leave New Parm and take her... To get there, we just have to leave New Parm and take the Merle Road. Come on, Justin, let's go. Okay, okay, where's... Where's her house? I swear I've been in every house, but I couldn't, I couldn't find her. Oh! I had to leave, that's what, okay. Ooh, shiny thing. Oh yeah, pick that up. Brand new spanking enemy right there. Yeah, that's right. Let's try it. Is this one going to be dangerous? I doubt it. Probably going to be just like the other enemies. All right, time to auto. Oh, wait, no, wait, I don't want auto battle on. Ooh. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Okay. Um, tactics. I'm going to t turn their pet tactics back on the, on the manual. Yeah. All right. That was a cool move. I like that move. So, I'm glad I bought that magic. Apparently, it does something with my agility, I think. I don't know. Why does Sue need so much EXP to level up? Don't jump down at me, spider. Uh-oh. Ooh, two paths here. All right, just pick a direction and go. All right, more money right there. I wonder how much money I get every time I pick one of those up is... I hope it's more than 100. 
There was nothing down that path, so... I mean, there was some money, so I'm gonna go over here. Oh, a small little alcove. Ugh. Ugh. Sack of, myster of, of mysterious stuff. What is it? An earring. Interesting. An eagle eye view that does not help me at all. Of course, of course. <laughs> what is that? What is this? Oh, another mana egg. <laughs> can enemies drop those? That is a new enemy. Like, like, can I grind for mana eggs? Are those a a an, an infinite resource I can get, or is or are there a limited amount of them in the game? I don't know. I hope I can eventually get as many of those as I want. And I hope that magic isn't permanent. Like, I hope that... Like, if I buy a magic move I don't like, I hope that I can eventually just... Get rid of it for a different magic. You know what I mean? I should probably... Fill up a little bit, yeah. Man, that is powerful. Well, relatively. Apparently, it gets more powerful the more I use it, so... Alright, kill it, Justin. Sick him. Alright, awesome. One more battle, and I'm level 7. Great. Uh, this way. Another eagle eye view. Don't know what I was expecting. Alright, that's a scary looking enemy. Alright, let's fight! Let's fight, let's do it! Is it Cockatrice? Oh boy, I hope it's not anything special. Oh, there's four of them. Oh boy. This is scaly. All right. Uh, hold on a second. I'm gonna go all out. I'm, I'm gonna, yeah. So tactics. I'm going to, yeah, go wild and safety. All right. Dead. Ah, oh, thirteen. That's kind of a lot, considering that's, like, a fourth or fifth of my health. Oh my gosh. Kill me, Sue! I don't think she has any magic left. Can she not use her items to heal me? Oh, that- it ran away. Okay. It ran away, but it got hit by the second hit, so... All good. Oh, I got a lot of experience from that battle. Ooh. This way. Hold on a second. Yeah, I should really heal up a little bit. Yeah, I knew these would eventually come in handy. Stores 12 HP. 15. Alright, that's good. Ooh, money. I just used up a lot of healing supplies just now. I guess I can see why the developers are really giving me a lot of them. It's because, like, it's not like you can have so many in your, in in your inventory. Like, there's, like, a limited amount you can have at any given moment, so... You always have to put some of them in the chest. Justin, can you not do that? I want Justin to... When- when he's... Going wild, I- I- I would- I would want him to use his... Cyclone move, but I think he's out of magic right now. 
Yeah. Also, she is going to manual. Yeah. All right. Got it. All right. The combat in this game is actually straightforward. It's I, I thought it looked confusing at first, but it's not as scary as it looks. It's actually really simple. Well, well for now. Like, like everything works and functions as expected, pretty much. There are a lot of eagle eye views. I doubt there's anything special over there. I gotta get that money. Yeah, I'm out of SP for for rah rah. How do I get more? I don't have any item that can refill that. And I don't really want to backtrack to a town to get more either. Oh well. Ah, oh, more of those enemies. I really don't know if I should fight those. Because I'm basically out of healing supplies. Pretty much. Wait, what is this? Oh, Fina's house! Oh my gosh! Yeah, what a, what a crazy coincidence that I would just wander into Fina's house like this. Oh my goodness. I totally wasn't looking for it or anything. Beautiful little song playing. Nice. Hi, Fina. Hmm, so this is Fina's house. Hey, it looks like a really bubble house. I wonder if she's... I wonder if she built it herself. Cool, this furniture looks like it was handmade by Fina. I'd like her to show me around here. Yeah, let me just barge on in. I love how the fire right here is animated. That is so charming. This game is just charm. It's, it's charm the game. Hint. Cover weaknesses. If you always use the same weapons, you will decrease the skill parameter only for that weapon's skills. I mean, you will increase the skill parameter only for weapon skills. Your strengths will grow, but your other parameters will improve. You may end up with many weaknesses. Either improve the weak parameters by improving other weapon skills or try to set up an array of supplies to cover your weaknesses. Got it? Well, you know, like what if... Like, how am I supposed to know what each enemy is weak to, you know? I feel like constantly switching weapons in an attempt to test which each and every enemy is weak to will just be a waste of time when I can just attack with what I have, you know? Like, just brute force it. That tends to work in these kinds of games. Most of the time. 25% of the time. What's over here? Nothing! A whole, a whole lot of nothing is over here. You know the grass blows like that? Interesting. Oh, look, Justin. Oh, how cute. I'd like to have one of those. So don't go around touching stuff. Fina might get mad at you. Hmm? These are, uh... Puh. Uh, panties! Exclamation point, exclamation point. Fina's panties taken. Don't, don't take them. What? Oh, Justin and Sue, you've come to visit. Oh, God, it's Fina. I'm so glad you came, and so soon, too. Uh, what, uh, I mean, it's just that, well, uh, Sue. So, hi, Fina. Justin, you've what, what? What have you got in your hand? Oh, Justin, what are you doing? Those are mine. Pervert slap. Oh dear, I usually don't leave this place in such a mess. No, no, I. Uh, it's fine, Fina. Really, what's wrong with you two? You're both blushing. I was just showing him something. That's all. I, okay. Oh, well, hey, are either of you hungry? Let's have something to eat. You were showing him? You weren't showing him anything. He just found those panties. What are you talking about? Hmm, that was delicious. I hadn't expected you to be such an accomplished cook. This mint tea is really good. Seems like Fina can do everything. 
Yeah, but Fina, you're living here all by yourself, right? Don't you get lonely sometimes? Oh, I guess so. But I wouldn't ever be lonely if you lived here too, Justin. Ooh, me, but I've got adventures. <laughs> so, um, okay. I guess so. I don't know. I kind of like the more shy response, but I also like the... Like this response. You know what? Let's make him a little bit shy. Haha, <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Justin, you thought I was serious? Nah, oh, nah, I mean, heck. I thought you were probably joking. Hee <laughs> hee, still, I liked your answer. Well, anyway, Justin, was there something else you wanted to talk about? So, what is it you wanted to talk about, Justin? May I borrow your new world map? Are you engaged to packing? Won't you go on an adventure with us? Ooh, I like all these questions. Let's ask the juiciest question first. Are you engaged? That reminds me, President Packin said something really weird. He said you and he were engaged. No, really? Engaged? Hmm, if that's Packin's for you, spreading nonsense like that, exclamation point, exclamation point. No matter what I said, Packin just wouldn't listen to me. What a nuisance. That's why I came here right away. I didn't want to run to Packin. I really wanted to show you around. Haha, <laughs> now I understand. I thought that was kind of strange. Now we get it, huh, Justin? So, Justin, is that all you wanted to ask? Nah, nah. You go on an adventure with us. Come on. Ina, why don't you come adventuring with us? To search for the legendary Angelou. You said it was the salt ruins on the continent of Messina, right? Would it... It would be incredible if the ancient ruins really did work. We were already there. Wait, well, that's confusing. So... Did I read that right, or did she just say that Angelou was the salt ruins? You know, I, I think I just read that wrong. They do work. They do, Fina. A girl named Liette told me so. She told us to head for Alent. Really? Is it true? Then the spirit stone is real. I thought Justin was dreaming. But that's great. It's quite a discovery. So, Justin, is that all you wanted to ask? May I borrow your new world map? I want to- I want to go to the Dumb Ruins. Would it be okay if I borrowed your new world map? I mean, your map of the new world? Didn't you join the Adventure Society? You, they should give you an Adventurer's map when you join. Join the Adventure Society? Never. That dude is no adventurer. He's just a lousy tour guide. The president is just a blabbering idiot. How to fool like him get to be president of the Adventure Society? But you know, you're different, right? You're a real adventurer. Still, I'm at a loss. The Adventure Society rules say I'm not supposed to lend the Adventure map to non-members. So if I lend my map to you, Justin, I can continue my work. Fuck the rules. Excuse my language, but seriously. Anyway, I'm sure some secrets of Angelou are hidden in the dumb ruins, so come with us to find them, Fina. Thank you for inviting me, Justin, but I just can't, I'm afraid. The Adventure Society rules say I'm not allowed to go there. It's funny that... <laughs> That cut in the music, like, halted my brain. Because as soon as the cut in the music happened, I just stopped reading, and I don't know why I stopped reading. Really now, Fina, all I hear from you is rules, rules, rules. Should there be any places anywhere where adventurers can't go? Justin, don't confuse pros with amateurs. Pros must follow the rules. That's the way it is for pros. If an adventurer breaks the rules, his pass gets taken away and he's out. This is so dumb. There does not need to be rules for this kind of thing. There are no laws near an adventurer. Come on. Justin, you must understand how hard it would be for an adventurer to be unable to go on any adventures. What a mouthful. So I need to hold on to this pass. That's where you're wrong. Yes, she's wrong. No adventurers without a pass. No choice of destination without an okay. What kind of adventure is that? Damn right, Justin. No one decides where the wind blows. Only the wind determines that. Like a true adventurer. A true adventurer is like the wind. Damn right. Two ellipses. Why are you so quiet now, Fina? You're not like those nerds in the Adventure Society, are you, Fina? No, but... Oh, new music. Oh, what's that music? Oh, she can hear it too? 
My dearest Fiennan, I've come for you. Uh, yep, uh, yep. In here, in here, in here, in here, in here. That's what everybody sounds like. I heard someone says, I heard someone say, uh, yep, just in that voice. Yes, it's so distinct. Wait, Justin. Wait here, Justin. I'll take a look outside. No, don't look. Get get Justin to look for you. Oh god, she's going. What is this green tea we're drinking? Yeah! Oh god, he just kidnapped her. Oh god, go, 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 go. Ah. Uh. Oh god, I knew this guy was a creep. Oh, where's Fina? Justin, look over there. Oh god. Go home, Pack, and I told you to never come here again, remember? Ah, but tonight is a night when our hearts will be united. Uh, yup, yup. Once you and I are married, Fina, you can wash our underwear together as a couple. <laughs> yup, yup. <laughs> Such a weird thing to say. Go wash your own underwear, Packin. I have no intentions of marrying you. How many times must I tell you? Uh, don't be so shy. Uh, yup, yup. I know. That you're really crazy about me, Fina. Uh, yup. Anyway, if you don't marry me, I'm going to take away your adventurous past. So there. Uh, yup. She's going to rip up that pass in front of you. That's what she's going to do. Through the pass. And if I do that, you can't go on any more adventures. Screw that. Packing, packing. That should be nothing to do. That should be nothing to do with whether or not we get married. Heck, you're such a sleaze bag. Fina just plain hates your guts. <laughs> Can't you get that into your head? What are you doing here at Fina's house? Uh, yep. Are you her boyfriend or what? Me, I'm just, uh, well, I'm her friend, I suppose. And I also stole her panties, but I digress. No, wait a minute. Actually, Justin is my, my fiance. We're getting married. What? Oh, uh, Fina. Look, we've got to coordinate our stories if we... Oh, she's whispering this. Look, we've got to coordinate our stories. If we don't, we'll never get Packin to give up, will we? I'm in love with him, Packin. He proposed to me a year ago. So I'm afraid I can't marry you. Yeah, she's right. Keep her paws off my girl. <laughs> nice. I'm sorry I never mentioned it to you, Packin, but I'm sure you'll find someone else and you'll be very happy. That's my bad. I mean, that's too bad, my dear Fina. You've been claimed by that silly boy. You know what? I'll help you, a yup. This is my kind of thing. I have my bodyguard along for a yup. I mean, this is the kind of thing I have my bodyguard along for. All right. Master Chang, come on. Oh boy. <laughs> What's that sound effect? Oh my god! <laughs> Watch out! What the fuck was that, Justin? Justin, you've taken harder hits than that. Ouch, ouch. Oh, what's this? Alright, Justin, you came too. Oh, that guy. I mean, did that Cheng beat me up? Yeah. Sue, where's Fina? <laughs> oh, Justin's pissed. Those guys took her with them. They said they're gonna get. They said they're gonna have a wedding. So Justin, what should we do? Oh god, I've got it, Sue. We're going to save Fina. I won't let Packin have his way. That's just what I was thinking. Let's go. We're off the new farm. Oh my god. <laughs> Recover. It it it'd be funny if 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 Justin's health was actually lowered from that. I I didn't check if it was. Oh boy. I know it's like cliche, but I got this like really stupid smile on my face. It's very charming. Like yes, I know it's cliche, but but I mean, but I mean, come on. How how can how can you not watch that cutscene and get a good laugh out of it? I love it. Yeah. Town of New Parm. Wedding. Okay, that would either be at the Adventure Society or that would be at the church. 
Let me check. Give me back my girl. Oh, he's not here. All right. He's at, he's at he's at the church. What a guy. At least he's getting married at the proper destination. It would have been funny if, if he tried to marry her in, in his office. That that would have been hilarious. Oh my gosh, where's the church? Yeah, oh, yeah, it's way over here. Oh, there, oh my gosh, there are a lot of people here now. Ugh. But go in. Authorized personnel only. What? How do I get in? Elf! Let me in! Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Brand new dungeon? Yes, brand new dungeon. Okay, I'm gonna go back and heal. I mean, I mean, buy buy more supplies. I I just healed, so I don't have to do that. But I am going to stock up a little bit before I go on forward. <laughs>